Hi, how are you? Um, I just wanted to speak to you a little bit today about some of the mail that I get from these guys. It's the Scientologists. They're nearby. They, they, I think they're based in my town that I live in. Um, anyways, I'm on their mailing list and I get this funny mail and it fascinates me. It really does. And I just wanted to point out some of the things about this particular letter. This free wins Church of Scientology flagship service org uh, made out to me in my address. Uh, anyway, it states here, nothing is bigger than the physical universe. Think about it. Think about it. Nothing is bigger than the physical universe. And yet, that doesn't really blow me away because if something was bigger, then technically the universe would encompass that, and that would be that would be just part of the universe. That would just make the universe bigger. So nothing nothing is bigger than the physical universe. Think about it. And I'm thinking, and I just it, uh, I'm, I'm, I don't get it. And this little little image here, it seems to be a um, it's a microphone above a book. It's like the it's like the microphone is picking up what the book is saying. That doesn't make any fucking sense. Pardon my French. It doesn't make any sense. That's just hilarious. I love it. I got some other stuff I should show you. Maybe I will. Okay, now I've opened it up and we've got the golden age of knowledge. Come to the free winds and do the full lineup of basics, books and lectures courses. Let me tell you, basically Scientology loves microphones and they love gold. Everything's fucking gold. Everything's gold. Uh, and flags, lots of flags. And they love boats. They love boats. I think, and columns and stuff. A lot of the, the pamphlets and things that I get have a lot of gold, a lot of boats, a lot of nautical stuff, and um, a lot of flags. I see the word flag a lot. A, lo a lot, a lot. Um, very nautical. Don't know why. Um, don't have the knowledge. Uh, and then I got this little pamphlet too, which I just think is great. I love, I love their... Um, everything that they do. Look at that. What does that mean? That's, it's like symbolism without meaning. You know, unless you know the meaning, in which case you're one of them. Um, flows. Basic agreement and prove it. Once again, think about it. Think about it. Flows. You, you, basic agreement, but then prove it. Yeah. I just do not have the information in order to, to prove these things. You have to be able to want and experience the sensations of this universe. You have to take, as a high level of tolerance, its speed. In other words, you've got to be able to live in order to back out of the universe. <laughs> right? God, preach on! What the hell does that mean? God, ah, uh, can you tolerate the speed of the universe? Can you? Hurry up! I thought I was done, but then lo and behold, lower in my stack of mail is something else. Yes. Look at her. I'm on the basics at Flag, are you? She's a pretty girl. Sweet looking, you know? You see a lot of pretty Scientology girls walking around. What can I say? From clear to eternity. Wow. There's always pictures of these events, you know, happening somewhere at some flag Scientology gathering. And there's always, oh yeah, some podiums. Yeah, gold and the word flag. Um, what 
what I wonder is where does that happen? Where is this place? Because the people are always so stoked and they always seem so happy to be there. But it just always looks like it's on some studio or some something. I just think the idea that this is actually happening somewhere, that this many people are getting together and being like, yes! Knowledge! Us! On the same page! That's... I don't know. Anyways, I just wanted to point that out. Stand up at the podium. Sounds great. Anyway, thanks for tuning in. Bye now. Wait, but then I saw this. My advice, one day at a time, and show up. Come on. Hey, hey, that's AA talk, okay? One day at a time. They don't even insist that you show up. What a ripoff.